and we're going to start to think about expanding our synopsis or our story. Questions? Beautiful. So, Mr. Keynes is one of the only two African American teachers at our school. His culture positively affects many of his students in different ways and makes them more aware of black culture. He feels as if his race makes it easier to relate to his students and other students at DP. I really do think that the, the impact I have for, for lack of a politically correct term, I think that, you know, the, the black culture or the, the heritage and the roots of black culture is a mainstream thing now, whether it be the music, the elements, the idea of entertainment is deeply rooted in jazz and, and black song and dance and even now um, sports is, is dominated by the young black athletes. So I think that culturally um, I have a lot of relevant experiences that I can share with my kids that I think are positive. Diversity is a necessity for teachers because it can bring different ideas to their classroom, such as different styles of teaching or incorporating humor into their lessons. I think diversity of teachers helps students get education in a different way. You know, um, Mr. Dent is a very funny teacher and I think I am as well. The more we can show kids that stereotypes are just that stereotypes, but the black guy doesn't always act like this, the white guy doesn't always act like this, and so on. Um, I think our kids are better emotionally prepared for the real world. I think as being a young black person in a predominantly non-black environment, Santa Barbara, um, I did have to deal with a certain amount of diversity that I think most people are unaware of. I think that there's this idea that slavery was 400 years ago and none of us were slaves or slave owners, so it, it doesn't exist. But the idea of systematic racism and institutionalized racism um, still exists. And without talking to someone that is aware of that, how could anybody be aware, whether they be white or black? It's not about educating white people or brown people. It's about all people understanding that there's certain limitations within the institution, the way it's set up that is put people at a disadvantage. And, and I do take a certain amount of pride in helping explain that to students. I don't agree with the idea that people don't see color. I think it's naive to say that, oh, we're all just people. No, you know, our differences are what make us unique. You know, the fact that I am black makes me who I am. I couldn't imagine being anything else. So I appreciate my culture just as any other person should appreciate and, and, and understand their culture. What I think is, is the special part is understanding the idea of that a stereotype is a prejudgment on a group of people that ultimately is just that. It's a prejudgment and it shouldn't be a standard.